Hi friends, Mark Jones, the consigner's designer, and I'm still here in the Dunwoody store, but today we're going to do a class for you. So many of you ask me about staging your bookcases that you just don't have any idea. And a lot of you have built-ins beside your fireplace, and those need to look stunning because that's usually a focal point of your room. I have many clients that have me come just stage their bookcases sometime. So I'm gonna kind of show you. Now we have a wonderful bookcase to work with here. And um, it is down, it's a new piece, one of our new pieces, it's down to $13.59.99. We still are honoring the 10% discount on any online sales. And also our two movers, Gene Spencer and Trent Lees, are offering you a $50 discount if you need to have a piece of furniture moved to your home. Otherwise, you can pick up things that you see online or in the videos in the stores. So let's get started on our class, okay? Um, I'm ready to go here. So beautiful bookcase, it's deep, it has a lot of detail, but it's very white inside um, with the wood tone outside and then some gray at the bottom. So it does have that new, more traditional farmhouse look that is very popular right now. And it has all the detail inside, but we're gonna make this thing really pop and as you would want it to look in your room. So I do always like lighting in bookcases. Um, if you decided to put a lamp in the top as I have done here, you probably would have to drill a little hole in the back to run the cord out of it, and I would certainly do that because I want the lighting in there. Or you could add um, some lighting in the top of this. You can you know, drill those hole and add those pot lights that you put in the top of bookcases. It would only light up the top shelf, but that would be fine. So, um, and on this side, I have put a lidded vase that is kind of an oriental feel. It's a black vase that has a lot of reds and greens in it. That's kind of, kind of set the color tone and the color palette that we're gonna use for accessorizing this bookcase. So we're gonna start here. On this side with the lamp, I'm gonna put this red hand-blown vase to bring some of my red. Now, I love to put artwork into the bookcase, smaller artwork, so I'm gonna use these pieces and they bring up the red and the black out of my vase over here, and they're of palm trees. They have black frames and gold, and I'm gonna layer them. See the three dimensions that we did here? So I'm gonna layer those up right in the middle of my top shelf. Now, I'm gonna add a couple of books over here. And you see, I lay these books down. Books don't always have to be standing. So I'm gonna use them, and I'm gonna put a little finial on top of that. So we have our top shelf going here, and you see how this is starting to come to life. So, in my metal shelf here, I'm gonna go ahead and add this red 12 metal planter, and that's gonna bring in the red tones that I've used up here and add some interest. You could put plants in there if you wanted to. You could fill it with artichokes or something like that, interesting, or the moss balls, that would look pretty. Um, right now, I, I don't have any of that to put in there, but I probably would do that. I'm also going to add some more artwork and I'm going to kind of come over to this side and add a little bird picture that's in the rusty red tones. So that's very nice. These books I have are actually done in the red tones and I'm going to add some of those over here. Stand some of them up. We're going to let these use them as our bookends again. I love the old antique books. It doesn't matter me, to me that the covers may have a little bit worn or falling off as you see in that one. It's fine. Maybe we'll put that one up. There we go. So, we've added some more books on that side and to balance, and I love that. Now, speaking of books, we need to balance book on all the shelves. So here we go with some that are bound in kind of a gold color which I particularly love. Once again, I'm going to lay one down and use it as my bookend. And I'm going to put a red oriental bowl on there. Once again, adding a pop of red to that shelf on there for me. Now, in the middle, slightly angled, I'm gonna put this flirtedly red planter. And I have like two more finials here that I'm gonna to add to that side. So that adds me some contrast to, I have some dark going on over there. And I particularly like that. More books are going on this side. 
I'm going to put a book with a box on top of it as my bookend on that one. So we've got three shelves done and you see there is a equal placement of the reds and the blacks and the gold going on in this. So have more books in the same tone. I'm going to add on this side and I particularly like that. Have a few more books here and I'm going to add a black vase on top of that book section, once again using them as my holder. On the bottom shelf I'm going to do another red planter that brings in my red tones. It's kind of oriental theme like the ones we did on the top. I have a couple of red ceramic pieces that I want to add here on this shelf to add more pop of red. I have a few more books I'm going to add over here. This time I'm just going to stack them like that. Add that little dimension. And I'm going to put a couple more right here with another finial on top of that. We're almost done. Quick and easy. Got a beautiful crystal piece here that I'm going to put down here on the bottom. And another little oriental bowl that I'm going to put in the top. So, as you can see, it's easy to stage your bookcase. You do a mixture of things that makes it much more interesting. And you too can do this. Just watch this tutorial and kind of pull things from around your house or come to Southern Comforts and purchase some of these things that I showed you or things that are in your color scheme to add to your bookcases and make it more interesting with your books. I want to show you a couple of other things. This round table that is in the store, it's one of our pieces. It's a great table. It's $699.99. You'll get 10% online sales. There are six of these wonderful leather Louis chairs that came in. They are consigned. And the whole set of six are down to $799.99. Oh, I'm sorry, there's a discount on those. They are down to $559.99. So a set of six Louis leather chairs, $559.99. And they're just great, or you could have them covered, but the finish on them is just absolutely wonderful. So I wanted to show you a couple of those things. So I hope that you enjoyed the class. I hope you got some ideas to stage your bookcases. And I uh, please send in ideas to me of things that you would like to see me do. I love to have those ideas and to roll them around in my creative process so I can bring them to you. So follow me on Facebook at Mark Jones, the Consigner's Designer. And Southern Comforts is also on Facebook and Instagram. I am on Instagram under Designer Mark. So I'd love you to join me in my ventures in decorating, and I will see you very, very soon.